and very popular feature each and every Saturday night during Sevens Big League for season 1985 is NEC Fantastic Footy Flashbacks. Let's go up now to Sandy Roberts and find out what he has for us this week. Thank you, Peter, and welcome once again to NEC's Fantastic Footy Flashbacks. This year we go back to a year that is considered by St Kilda supporters the greatest ever. Of course, it can only be one, 1966. A number of top Tasmanian footballers have come over and played so well in the VFL, but possibly none better than our special guest tonight. He was the best and fairest of the St Kilda Football Club in three years, 1962, 63 and 65. He was captain from 1963 through until 1968, and he was the leading goal kicker in 1962, 63, 64 and 65. He was affectionately known as the Doc. So tonight, let's relive some of the great highlights of the career of Daryl Baldock. Forward pocket, Cooper's a chance here. Silvani, oh, Cooper to Baldock. There it is. Afterwards, centre half forward, where Potter goes for it. Baldock also beating them all in. Down on the ground. Oh, oh look at play. that beautiful fork. His kick looks... Here sends it towards Oakley. Oakley kicks up towards centre half forward. Baldock is running in with the flow of play and takes a good mark. And didn't that take some courage? Over centre half forward. Baldock is leading out for it. Baldock goes up one hand, pulls it in with the other. Gets it across to McMaster Smith. He's been quiet in this quarter. McMaster Smith drives up towards the forward pocket. A chance for Collingwood to clear here. Down the Baldock. He's running into an open goal. He kicks. It's there. Alan Morrow and McGrath go for it. Both number eights. North Melbourne hit in towards the go. Ball off. Ball off. Left foot. Along the ground when Baldock's coming in to try and make a good old picture of his open. Try beautiful football. Looks for Rollins. And Ian Rollins marked in a forward pocket. He's playing on straight away. Baldock's come up, accepted a hand pass, running into the goal mouth. Now he kicks. And it's a goal. He kicks it down here to Minot. Minot can't go. It's a magic. It's a magic. Running into an open goal. Ball bouncing around the goal area now. Picked up by Baldock. Driving down towards Baldock. Out flies Matthews. Couldn't hold it. Baldock picks up. Trying to break out of the pack. He's clear now into a left foot. He steps the goal. The double move. Throws it over to Baldock. And Baldock's done it again. Bullock sets himself, he drives goal, what's that tell you? That's pretty good from here. Finds St Kilda going into attack, here's a chance for Darrell Bulldog. Bulldog into an open goal, he kicks. Oh, just two and a ten and a half for it. Oh, look at it. a glorious hand pass to Bulldog. Bulldog into an open goal, good football. Hit down, but it's smothered away, seems to be all Richmond down on the ground. Mackenzie in there, Bulldog gets it, turns onto the right foot, shoots at goal. It looks good. Isn't it great to see the dock, Darrell Bulldog, in action once again, and what a champion he was not only for the St Kilda Football Club, but also for the VFL. Well, Darrell's sporting interests haven't been confined purely to football. He's now over in Tasmania, a successful horse owner and breeder. And who knows, if that success follows on, we may well see him back here in Melbourne come the first Tuesday in 1 November in the not-too-distant future. We'll have more great highlights of days gone by next week in NEC's Fantastic Footy Flashbacks. Throughout season 85, all letters will go into our fantastic footy flashbacks barrel and be eligible to win one of six magnificent portable televisions from NEC. At the end of the season, all entries will go back into the barrel for the major prize draw of this outstanding 63 centimetre stereo colour television and a VHS video hi-fi from NEC. High technology colour television and video.